Yo, what's good people? It's Jay Cactus, and in today's video, yo, today's video is a special one because over the weekend we just hit 100k subscribers. I don't even know what to say at this point, it just feels unreal. And I know for a fact it couldn't have happened without the amount of love that you guys show. Always watching my videos, liking them, commenting on them, joining the premieres, getting involved in the Discord, the community, just any way that you've been showing support. So I want to say a massive thank you to you because, yeah, it just left me speechless. It's a huge milestone for me to hit, and I feel like it's that big one that everyone aims for as soon as they start a channel so as a way to give back to everyone and show my appreciation i've arranged another huge giveaway and this time i've got almost seven thousand dollars worth of prizes to give out so once again we've beaten the last one and yeah this one's just crazy i think you're gonna love this one i'm gonna go through the full list of prizes so you know exactly what you can get but if you want to enter it's really simple it's completely free all you need to do is leave a comment in this video and then at the end of the comment leave a cactus emoji and then if you want to double your chances of winning head over to my instagram at jcactus music and then check my recent post and yeah if you're wondering what all the prizes are this time i'll go through the full list now so the first place prizes are the complete 13 bundle by native instruments this is just a crazy prize it's worth around 1400 packed with the sickest contact banks and yeah just shout out to native instruments for this one it's mad next we have heat up 3 ultimate edition by initial audio and again this one's just packed with sound banks and you even get a physical hard drive to keep all of the banks on you'll also get a full year subscription of busyworks beats training so shout out to busyworks beats man he's been a huge help to me you'll get the full bundle by bleece they have some sick creative effect plugins like reverb shimmer chorus flanger everything that you can think of but it's a bit more advanced than the usual stuff you'd use you'll get all of my kits so my drum kits my loop kits midi kits one shot kits basically everything on my site you'll also get a signature edition version of fl studio you'll get the mixed and key producer bundle which includes all the captain plugins mixed and key studio edition and odyssey you'll get the full addictive keys bundle by xln audio the full baby audio bundle including the latest plug-in tape you'll also get scorch by sourceware and my best friend jacob a free subscription to tracklib for a whole year the full shaper box bundle by cable guys the chambers bundle by llb and the fl studio shortcut mousepad by lario the second place winner will get all of my kits studio grand for addictive keys plus rc20 by xln audio a producer edition version of fl studio slice by initial audio Audio, the full shaper box bundle by cable guys and the chambers bundle by llb the third place winner will also get all of my kits they'll get the producer edition of fl studio slice by initial audio rc20 by xln audio the shaper box bundle by cable guys and the chambers bundle by llb so yeah there's some crazy prizes to give out so i want to give a massive shout out to all the sponsors that got involved so yeah just make sure you don't miss this opportunity it's completely free to enter so good luck to everyone that's going to enter i'm going to be announcing the winners on Tuesday the 8th of February and yo if you only clicked on this video for beat making content then right now I'm going to be making a beat with my guy Saint Cardona he's a sick producer and this is a beat that I'm going to be working on for my upcoming instrumental album it's going to be the prick tape volume 4 I wanted to make sure that Saint Cardona got on as a feature so he sent me a loop that he's made with one of his boys he goes by Soldier Red and yeah the loop's sick it's like a melodic guitar melody so I feel like I can make something for someone like Central C so yeah I won't keep you waiting any longer let's get straight into it all right, so as I said, my guy Saint Cardona, Soldier Red, sent me this. Such a sick loop. I think the guitar might have been played live. I'm just testing it down. But I think I prefer it up. Could even try it up another one. I kind of like it there, F sharp, so we'll go with that for now. Alright, and I think I'm going to go straight in with the counter snare, something like this one. I'm just going to copy it out a few times. So we'll start with a basic pattern. And then I'm going to go with maybe something like this. I'm just trying to use different ones because I use the same counter snares all the time. And I just like to pick two with different tones. So this one sounds quite lower. This one's quite higher. Try 
Should I roll this one actually? And then I'm gonna repeat this roll at the end, but maybe just make it a little bit different. So I've left the first ones kind of simple. And then in the second ones, I'm just gonna pan these a bit. So I'm gonna hit Alt and R, make sure bipolar's on, and then I'm just gonna adjust the panning. I think I'm actually going to use a rim for this one. You can just copy that over, maybe add one here. Or actually, I might use this crispy snare and then use the rim to add more bounce. Let's try that. Let's see how this is sounding. And then for the snare, or it's more of a clap. Just add a few more here. All right, for the 808, I think I want to go with just my go-to New York one. I know it's not really a New York type of beat, but I think this one's going to work. All right, and I think the progression's going something like this. Oh, you know what? I haven't actually used it for a good few videos, but I might have to go back to the trusty old fat and wide. This one always sounds sick for melodic guitar beats. See what I'm saying? Always cuts through mixes as well, so I think I'm gonna go with this. So I've just copied it over and because this part I feel like there's quite a bit going on I'm going to simplify the first section. Have these going down. All right, so yeah, at the end, I think I can leave three in this one and then going back to that first one, maybe four there. Alright cool, I've got the main drums in now, so I just need to add a couple perks and then some effects. I think something like this will fit the vibe. Alright, and I think something like this. So I'm going to bring these ones down Make the pan one too Alright, let's add a couple risers in there as well Alright, 
Alright, and I think I want another one in here. Just because I want to add a little break and I'll show you what I mean when I start arranging it. So yeah, right now I'm just going to go ahead and split the pattern. I'll start arranging it and then I'm going to add a few chops in there as well. So I'm just going to rearrange this. So this is obviously going to be the hook with all the vocals in there. So yeah, I'll keep this as a verse and then this will be the hook. So yeah, let's bring this for the intro. bring that rim in as well this can go there So yeah, with the second transition, I wanted this here because I'm going to add a break in the drums here. So I'm going to make a few cuts there, get rid of this bit, and then just rearrange some of these kicks. Might make those longer, actually. And then I'm just going to bring this transition in here. And then this one part from my old kit. I always go back to using this one. And in this end section, I'm going to copy this over again or bring it down an octave. Well, let's try half time instead. That could work, you know. And then I think from here, I could probably just copy this over. And then in this bridge bit, I'm going to add a sub bass. Okay, and then for the outro, I'm just going to copy that bridge over. And then I think it can fade out like that. All right, and I just want to add one last thing, and it's going to be a piano, but I'm only going to leave it in one section of the beat, probably like just before the bridge or something. Alright, and the last thing I'm going to change is just in the 8 weight because I think the third chord is actually B minor. It sounds fine on E, but B is going to be the better option, just if I want to follow the exact progression. So I'm just going to bring the first ones down and keep the second ones on E, and then bring this one up an octave. So yeah, I pretty much got the beat now. I'm going to do any last minute mixing if I need to, and then I'll show you the final outcome. All right, so I didn't really add anything else, just the tags, and then I think one effect. But I'll play it from the beginning and talk you through everything. So in the intro, we've just got the guitar melody, and then the tags in there. And it's a 16 bar intro for this one. So just to build up energy, we've got one counter snare. And the second one and then the rim as well that signature pause drop so we're in the hook in this section and then this is that break I added Kind of feel the energy dip. Then I just added one gunshot effect here. So we've got those two A way patterns playing all the way through. And then we've got 
got the piano. I don't know why it's down there. Yeah, for the bridge, it just added half time and then an EQ to cut out some of the loads that half time created. So, yeah, straight back to the hook. And then, like you saw me earlier, I just copied everything across. So I hope you liked the video and I hope you were feeling the beat. And once again, if you want to enter the giveaway for free and have a chance to win almost $7,000 worth of prizes, then just leave a comment in this video and put a cactus emoji at the end. And then if you want to double your chances of winning, head over to my Instagram at jcactusmusic and you'll see my recent post there. So good luck with the giveaway. And once again, I appreciate you all for your support and getting the channel to 100k subscribers. I can't even explain how much it means to me, but yeah, much love to everyone for supporting. Thank you all and I'll see you next time.